Hello guys, and welcome back to another Minecraft Bedrock Survival Let's Play. Today, we are going to be, um, hopefully doing the dragon, if we have time. So, I've got a few things prepped for the fight. Mainly, I brewed a bunch more of these slow-falling potions, because I think we're going to need them. Um, I also went on chunk base and got the location of the stronghold. Because I don't want to waste eyes getting there. <clears throat> Little cheaty, I know, but it will help us out in the long run. Mainly, I just want to kill this dragon. That was my goal from the start, and I'm just now getting to the to the point. I'm just now to the point where I could do it. Actually, I've been at the point where I could do it for literally months now, but... Yeah. So, I'm gonna harvest this real quick, and I'll catch you guys once that's done. Alright, that's that job done. Oh yeah, also off-camera, I did a little bit, mainly crafted the... Um, Ender Pearls into Eyes of Ender. And we will be bringing this with us. Very, 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 very useful thing. In fact, I will probably... I probably have enough obsidian to craft another one. And we might craft another one and take that with us. Because... I'm not sure if I. I'm not so. I'm not sure if I trust bringing uh, our only Ender chest with us, even though the only thing in it is firework rockets. Because I plan on immediately going for an Elytra. Because I mean, let's be real here. That is. One of the only reasons people go to the end, and yeah, I want to. I want a few of them bad boys. I'm not sure if there's anyone in here that sells on breaking though. Is there? Prot. Don't take this method. Always go for a higher level of protection than protection one. I learned that because doing it from protection one takes so much XP, it's not worth it. So there is one that says in breaking two. Okay, noted. How much is mending? God, I could have gotten so much of a better price than that. So these these are these are the areas where I made mistakes. Uh, just give me all of those, please, and thank you. That is more than enough. I probably could have done this legit if I had wanted to, but... Okay, let's make... Let's uh, get some of our investment back here. Yeah, we got enough to enchant... Um, on the off chance that I might die with this, I am going to actually, yeah, this needs to go back in this chest here. On the off chance that I might die, I am actually going to go ahead and enchant probably a bow. I'm probably going to enchant a bow. Because, I mean, uh, let's be real here, that's the only thing I have I could possibly enchant is a bow, so might as well go for it. Um, hmm. I so bad want an infinity bow. And as I've stated before, I am done with villagers. Well, no, I'm not going to say that. My plan in future episodes moving forward 
is to do what I did in my Let's Play World, not Let's Play World, my Long Term World, which I showed you guys last time. And that is separate villagers for pretty much, or separate villages for pretty much everything. Which that's gonna, that's gonna be some work, but I think it's worth it. <clears throat> no, it's not, and I think it's worth it. I know it's worth it. <clears throat> Maybe I could just have a mixed village. If worse comes to worse, I could just always find another village. Uh, perfect. 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 Um, anvil. I am now entirely more confident. The only thing that sucks about an infinity bow is you can't put mending on it. That's the only thing. But when it's that powerful, and I can always... I have I have a spawner I can I I can get all the XP I could ever want Oh yes Okay all that's left is golden apples which I think I have a, some already crafted for this not entirely sure. I'm going to go put these down here. Also, shulker boxes. Oh, shulker boxes. Sweet shulker boxes. I can't wait. And protection of four. Actually, this goes in misc. Hey, that, that'll go in misc for now. I'll put that in the... Uh, Brew house at a later date. Uh, food, food, food. Even though I probably have enough, it never hurts to err on the side of caution and have some in the inner chest. And provided I don't get, um, I should also probably take some wood. Because that can be crafted into planks, which can be used for building material. Smart. Very, very smart. Uh, wood, 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 wood. It's on this side right. I don't remember where the wood chest is. I explored this world a few days ago to get me back into it. There. That ought to be enough. Um... That's fine. That's fine. Everything's fine. Everything's fine. Everything's fine. I'm trying to convince myself everything's fine, but I'm not so sure it's working. Um, we need a bed. So, put that in there. Two, three. Yeah. This goes at the stronghold. And put that there. That's good to go. Mm. Actually... I'm going to put this back for a minute because I'm going to go buy or make an Unbreaking 3 book. 
I'm going to go buy an Unbreaking 3 book and a Mending book because it's always better to put those on an Elytra as soon as you possibly can. So I'm going to take the Anvil with me. And I'm going to put that in my Ender Chest. Yeah. That sounds like a solid plan. At least it's solid in my head. I don't know if it's actually going to work. I hope it works, but... This is Minecraft Bedrock. This should work. I don't think I have anything I can be. I should be stressed about. This armor is pretty much netherite armor, just minus the knockback resistance. So I shouldn't have anything to be worried about. One never knows. And this... I'm already ready to enchant again. Unfortunately, I don't have anything to enchant, so that's... Unfortunate. The shit is unfortunate. Um... I need a book. Purchase... Now, how much is the Unbreaking 2 books again? 25 each. That's a fucking rip-off. Anyone ever tell you you're ripping people off? Well, you are. Uh, hang on. I'll be back. Alright, so I'm on my way back over to the uh, tradey guy. The cartographers, I think they're the yeah they're the ones that buy paper. So I'm on my way back over. I harvested my sugarcane farm, plus grabbed what I had in the chest, and it's time to go make some deals here. Um, paper. All right. I don't think this is going to make me enough for two books. Yeah, no. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Uh, I'm not I'm I'm not short a lot. I'm not short a lot. Uh I n I actually not going to say that because I probably will have to buy more of these in the future. But Okay. Let's get to whatever anvil I'm going to nab to take with me. Uh, boop, boop. Boop, boop. I don't care about this cost. It's worth it. That's what I'm telling myself anyways. Um, that could be faster. All right. Bed. Log, log. And that. Hang on a minute. All right. Just had to take a little bathroom break. Uh, figured I'd better do it now. Whilst I still have the chance. So. Supposedly our stronghold is at. 864. On the X. 1284 on the Z. So that way essentially. Which. May pose a problem. Because I don't have. 
the inventory space. Um, it might just be a good idea to leave these here and top off on that. Um, okay. I thought you had a trident. I have had great luck in this world with tridents. Hiya! That's not as, that's not what I had in my head. I pictured it being cooler, but, uh, uh fuck it. <laughs> So, basically, a whole lot that way and a whole lot that way. Uh, I don't like going through snowy biomes. Oh, sh sorry. I bumped the mic stand. I guess this could be up a little bit higher and over. It's a bad thing about these boom arms is... Unless you bought one of the um, expensive ones, which mine is not. Mine was only like 20 bucks on Amazon. <laughs> Actually, it's not that bad of a product other than you can't have the mic above you if you wanted that. So you'd have to buy one of the long ones. So this one is not. So that's the only unfortunate thing. Um, so it looks like we're going to have to have our convert some of these early. No problemo. But yeah, I'm going to pause here, and I'll see you at the um, stronghold. You know, it honestly wouldn't surprise me if this was above a deep dark. And by the way, I, I hate powdered snow. Oh. There it is. But no, yeah, I fell in powdered snow so many times. I hope I didn't misread on chunk base that there was a minus in there. Because if I did, I made this journey for no reason. And... I have to be honest, I'm having a hard time putting that thought out of my head. Bed check, okay. And there she is. Coordinates were a little off, but I'm not I'm not going to say that because it did say to the stair room. That, that clearly was not the stair room. Um, does not look like there's anything in there. I will come back for those books, though. Do I really need them, though? Not really. So if you don't know, the uh, stronghold nether portal thing will always be three to four rooms away. Or four to five rooms away from the uh, main thing. So you can always count. Most of the time. Unless it's glitched and either not here. Which could. That can happen. Or it's behind a wall. Which is very annoying. I've had that happen a couple of times. A big clue that you're getting close is if you start hearing silverfish. Yeah. You always.
always want to try to crit them and kill them as fast as possible because if if you don't, they will summon their friends and you will have a very, very bad time. So what I'm going to do here is... Okay, good. I'm going to take and put this over here. Don't go over there, don't go over there, good. Okay. I believe I can do that. And be able to do the rest of this okay. Might I just say that non-Depth Strider boots kind of suck? Um, Cause they do. And it is dark over there and I can't see a thing. Alright. So that would be our nether portal done. Unfortunately I kind of forgot the fact I have no way to light this. What am I talking about? Of course I do. Um, boop, 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 uh, water, lava, well, that was fast. Now I'm going to load... I'm surprised one of these isn't um, monster stuff. I'm honestly surprised I haven't found infested blocks yet. Truth be told. Because that's normally the way that it goes, isn't it? Now this is really going to suck if there's a ghast over here and he blows out my portal. Ah! Ah! Not only is it the worst biome, it's next to one of the things you don't want to spawn next to. S H N P one oh seven thirty five one five one five seven. All right, that's noted down. Back through the portal. Man, that's going to be a pain building over to that. I think I might just put my nether portals in the roof like I tend to do. Because, God, it has got to be a lot safer than... Uh... Whew. All right. And here's where I get to do it, that typical YouTuber thing. And we will be entering this portal in the next episode. Don't you just love it when people do that? I know I sure don't. 
<laughs> well, anyway, I'm going to do this next episode because I feel like this may drag on to an hour if I step through this portal now. So, yeah. I'm going to go ahead and end this one here and catch you guys in the next one, which I'll be recording straight away. So, peace. Let me put this back first. Now, peace. <laughs>